Hi, this is Thunder E from BorderWork.com, and today we'll be doing a review of the Blue Aura wireless uh, speaker system. This is a stereo loudspeaker system that actually you can place around your house. It's a wireless speaker system. It um, houses the Texas Instruments uh, DSP Class D amplification. So it's got a built in um, receiver here in each speaker, both left and right. Uh, it's got a 25 meter range and um, you know, uh, it uses RF band. Um, I believe the band is 2.4 gigahertz. So let's look at all the things that come with it. You do have your power cables for each speaker. You plug it in. Um, this is your AC adapter for each speaker. See that there? So you have two pretty much to come with it. You've got your instruction guide. So it works with PC and Mac. Shows you uh, interface uh, and also how to set it up, which we'll show you. It's very easy, actually, a very easy setup process. And uh, in here, you have your receiver now. So I'll show you that in a second. So, what else do we have here? We have an AC adapter, USB plug in, some lighting cables, instruction manual for the, re for the transmitter. Sorry, no receiver. <clears throat> and the transmitter itself. This works via USB, and what this allows you to do is I'll show you here. Pretty much, pull this out. Connect it via USB. Your um, PC or Mac reads it as a headset and sends information to it, and then of course it sends it to the speaker. Or if you use an MP3 player, you can actually just plug your MP3 player here, and it would do the same thing with aligning cables. And of course, you push that to sync it, and you're done. Now, let's take a look at the speakers themselves. So, comes with two speakers. This is the WS80i. Um, it's got this nice leather finish, very well tailored. Uh, you can see the uh, nice engraving of blue aura here on the top. Got, you know, some white threads at the back of the speakers. You can see it's only got a uh, power port and a station sink. That's pretty much it. You can see it's a 2.4 gigahertz wireless receiver. So ultimately what you can do is just place this anywhere in your house and you can connect uh, music wirelessly as you go ahead. And of course at the bottom of the speaker set it's got this nice suede uh, bottom. So nice cushion, put it on. You've got two speakers, all similar in style and design. Same thing with the second speaker here, which we can pull up. Again, the base station only has station um, sync and of course a uh, power plug and that's it so we're going to place this around the house we'll show you how it works connect it we'll listen to it listen to the sound um, and see how well the speaker set works now this is the w uh, ws80i which is about 599 and uh, we'll test it out and see if it's worth it all right all right so we have our blue aura speakers we have uh the two speakers set in two separate rooms so you guys can see how they work wirelessly. Now, this is not connected to my computer system, which I can show you here. That's a speaker. That's my computer here. And of course, you can see the wireless dongle over there. So it's connected via USB. Let's take the USB stick out of the way. Show you right there. And of course, we have our remote control. Now, you know, with the uh, Blue Aura speakers, you have three uh, zones. You can see that remote control. That's A, B, C. The B zone uh, basically allows you to have uh, both speakers on the same channel so you can actually control the volume from one place. You don't have to move around from speaker to speaker to control uh, your volumes. You can do two speakers in one channel, change channels, uh, put other speakers on another channel, and so on and so forth. So that's the kind of setup you have. Now the A and C, so the blue B channel is a blue, the A is red, and C I believe is green. And those are separate channels so you can have individual volumes for each speaker or each zone if you will so now we have this connected let's show you how it works i'm going to play some audio here and since this is border work we like to hear ourselves or so we're going to play some uh some videos from border work now the speaker is not on now if i actually hit the button we're having a battle between the evil 4g lte from htc and the galaxy s3 from samsung both so you can hear just give me a sample quick sample of the sound volume and you can hear and see that from both speakers um in uh both rooms 
uh, noticing that uh, what you get is very clear, crisp sound. It's um, it's a lot of bass to it, which we'll, we'll play some music for you so you guys can hear that too. But it's a lot of bass. There's a lot mm -hmm. of clean sound. Um, it, it's just very nice. You uh, when you play music on there, there's no crackling. You know, there's no distortion. Uh, what you expect from most wireless speakers is that you get a lot of distortion uh, from the radio frequencies. You don't get a good um, sound output, but you get solid bass, good sound output on the speakers. Now, of course, if you go past the uh, required distance, I believe it's 30 feet, then you start noticing some distortion because, of course, you're losing signal strength. But within the framework where your speakers are set to be, within the 30 feet uh, framework, it, it, it's almost flawless. It's pretty impressive for wireless speakers. <laughs> So just muting that for a second there with the mute button. You can just hear how crisp and clear that is. The wireless speakers in two different rooms, getting solid sound, uh, no distortion. Again, within the um, required distance of 30 feet, you're getting very, very good sound. Um, yeah, uh, now let's just show you guys, um, you know, the different zones and how they work. So I'm going to change the uh, zone frequency while that song is playing. I have this muted. So I have this in A. Let's change that. Let's change stations. In red. Of course, I do have to change it over here to match. So basically tap that. That's red. Station. So what you notice is that now that's on red. The other the other station is on blue. So I'm gonna go ahead over there and change that now, so you guys can see that um, I can do individual volume changes with each different station. It's gonna be hard to cue that up, but I'll try to cue the sound for you so you guys can hear that perfectly. So it's red. Volume's pretty low on this track. Now this is flashing blue. I'm going to change stations here. And now that's now it's red too. So I can crank the volume up here while that's low on the other video. And you can hear that quite well. I can mute. And then you can continue from here. So you can have the different zones, um, of course, with your paired speakers. So you can actually have the left and right together. I'm just having, I just have separated speakers. You're just giving you an idea of how well it works. But in terms of sound quality and um, what you get from just overall, um, you know, just solid sound from the system, this I think works well at home. Um, probably one of the best wireless speakers I have used in general. Uh, most of them, I usually consider them crap, uh, but these work very well. You can place them in your living room, you can place them in your bedroom. Uh, I'm using them on my computer and it's just fantastic. Um, have no issues whatsoever. So it's one of those things where I will, you know, definitely say it's a solid buy. Um, these are very, very good speakers overall. Um, if you're looking for wireless speakers, these are great. Again, it's very simple to use. You know, you have your remote here where, of course, you um, you have your multi-zone, so you can actually select your zones at the bottom. You can change your zone stations. You have your volume, and of course, you have your mute and power button. The only thing I will mention is that once you turn the unit off and you turn it back on, the volume actually starts from its base volume level, so you do have to crank the volume up. That's one thing I've noticed, hopefully that changes, I think will change in the final product unit. Uh, remote control is very simple, easy to use, uh, you know, uh, you can easily just navigate and increase your volume uh, with this without any issues whatsoever. Uh, definitely love the product, I like what they've done with it, uh, especially the finishing, uh, which 
you guys already know I've seen with the leather accents around uh, soft leather padding on the top and the bottom of the device uh, fits well with the entertainment unit around your home um, I think it's just something solid and uh, just a clean music system overall so if you guys have any questions or any comments about this let us know don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter Facebook and YouTube it's all boy the work with two O's uh, so this is Thunder E saying thank you and always enjoy entertainment